Westside, Westside, Westside. Yeah, they got yeah. it bumping. We on the top, woo, woo. 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 Had to get it with my guys, never stop, woo, woo. Mr. Go. I mean, it's a little bit of both, uh, but especially in the morning, you know, when you wake up uh, before getting warm up and everything. Uh, walking in flip flops, it's obviously painful, but it's getting better. What, what is the treatment that you're doing on it? Like, what does that look like? Uh, just some treatment, uh, massages, and ice, mostly. And mostly time, I assume. Yeah, time is, yeah. time is the best treatment, of course. <laughs> was this is the first time you'd played pickup since you'd heard it? Yeah. Okay. Is this a situation where you probably you're only going to play one of these two games anyway, so give it another day? So. Yeah, um, yeah, probably yes. Uh, like I said, you know, time is the best, uh, the best healer, so that's why. Have you ever had an injury, anything like this? No, yeah. only ankle sprains. It's <laughs> like an ankle sprain, or it might have been an ankle when it first happened. Like, what, yeah. what did it feel like when you first, you know, you were coming down, you hit that heel first? It wasn't, that. it didn't feel like ankle sprain at all. Okay. Uh, I didn't really feel my ankle, but it was the heel. Uh, since since the beginning, so I knew it right away. How scary is that when you're going up for a dunk and next thing you know you're... Yeah, that was, that was a little scary in my mind, you know, that one second or two when I was in the air, uh, it was a little scary, but I think it, 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 it was nothing compared to what it could be. You don't, hide, you don't jump high enough for it to be a second. I do. <laughs> you saw it. <laughs> you cut those bunnies. So, so now we get a chance to ask you about your reaction to you know, the trade. Yeah, I mean, uh, he's a great guy, you know. Obviously, you can see it. the first game. Uh, first game, you can see how amazing of a player he is. Uh, but first, I want to just say, <clears throat> I want to thank Spence and Doe. You know, those are my guys. Uh, we'll obviously miss miss them here. And but yeah, Kyrie is Kyrie, man. What do you mean Kyrie is Kyrie? I mean, what do you think of Kyrie? What do you think of the NBA championship? NBA champion. Uh, Probably the best ball handler ever in the game. Uh, amazing player, and you know it was just, it's going to be fun with, to play with him. As obviously, I mean, if we talk about NBA offensive duos, if you're not at the top of the list, you're real high now. Do you do you think you have to adapt your game at all to to, to play with Kyrie? You know, what's kind of the feeling out process? Do you think uh, for that? Probably a little for sure. You know, I never I get it. I never play like with a guy like Kyrie. Uh, so it's obviously it's gonna be work in progress, but I think it's gonna be fine. At the same time, what did you see from Wednesday that you think will work well with you, especially the way Kyrie was working a lot off the ball, you know, things like that? Yeah, I think uh, <clears throat> we both can play off the ball, uh, especially for me. I think it's gonna be a learning process for sure because you know I didn't uh, outside of my first season I didn't really play off the ball. Uh, but with a guy like him, you know, it's going to be really easy. Are you excited to do that, to play off the ball, or are you looking forward to it? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, for sure. You, you joked about your body being, you know, well-suited for screening. But, you know, now that you have Kyrie, do you anticipate a lot of that? What do you think that looks like? Yeah, I think we're going to do that, too. You know, me and him pick and roll. Obviously, this new basketball era, you know, you have small pick and roll, too. So uh, it's a work, for sure. Luca, what's been your thoughts watching the last two games, particularly Josh and Jaden on Monday, the way they played and helped the team win, and Theo on Wednesday, having guys like that step to the forefront and win games while you're out? Oh, yeah, amazing, you know. Uh, give those guys opportunity to play, to prove themselves. Obviously, I think Josh has been playing amazing this season, uh, the whole season, you know. Uh, but a lot of guys, you know, Jaden's a rookie. He's, gonna, he's learning a lot. I think from the start of the season till now, he improved a lot. Uh, so I think we have a really good good group of guys. What did you think when you saw that uh, KD got traded to the Suns? Oh, I was surprised. It's a big, big move. How, how much of a threat are the Suns now? <laughs> Probably the favorite in the West, right? Yeah. That's it. Well, but here's the thing. Last time I said the Suns were favorite in the series, you got all pissed off about it. So. I was past, you know. I don't look at the past. I look at the future. <laughs> <laughs> Luca, when Kyrie was out there with the guys, the, the pace was a lot faster on Wednesday than you guys have typically played this season. How much of that do you think will stay with the offense now that he's here and now that Josh has a bigger role, or how much might change when you're back and you play with that more methodical, slower style? I think it's going to be faster pace for sure. You know, I think with uh, Kyrie and Josh, our our pace is way higher. You know, because they play really fast. Uh, you know, I can just throw the ball ahead. 
I think we can keep probably not the same pace, but a higher pace than we used to. And to go back to what you said at the beginning with uh, Joe and Spence leaving, what kind of interaction? I know you weren't with the team at that point, but what kind of texts or interactions have you had with them since uh, they're going to Brooklyn? Yeah, I texted them. You know, I just <clears throat> thanked them for all those years they were here. You know, the, especially though he's been here with me since day one. Uh, you know, that's my guy, that's my brother. So. Uh, both of them guys were, were amazing, so I really appreciate them. What are you going to miss most about Dorian? Do you have a favorite story or a favorite interaction you would you know, consistently have with him over, over the years? Uh, I don't know. There's a lot of stories. You know, We've been together for five years. Uh, Probably not all you can tell. Yeah. <laughs> but, you know, the way he works, the he's so humble. He's an amazing guy. And just those things, you know, to be with him every almost every day, it was amazing. Ask the people that do the ratings. Where do you think? When you look at the line, when, when you look at the roster as is, do you have a shot at you guys have a shot at? I never do these rankings and that stuff, so that's for the other people. I believe in my team, that's it. I was gonna say do you, do you do you look at this now and say, Hey, you guys have a legit chance to, to make a run through the West and it's gonna be a championship team? Yeah, for sure. Yeah. That's why I think every season, so that's what you got to believe. If you don't believe, you should be here. Yeah. Westside, Westside, Westside. Yeah, they got it bumping. We on the top. Woo, woo. 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 Had to get it with my guys. Never stop. Woo, woo. Mr. Goin' split the pie. Never stop. Woo.